road as you can see i'm rocking my onesie because i like to uh drive comfortable um i wasn't going to vlog because vlogging and driving is not safe i honestly don't recommend it but anyway welcome to jay nelly's app it's your girl jay nelly if you're new to the channel thanks for tuning in make sure you like comment and subscribe and make sure you turn on that post notification If you're new to the channel, I went to school in Indiana, you feel me? So I was in need of a road trip, cause your girl needed a trip. Like I was like, I wanna drive, I don't feel like flying, I don't feel like doing all that nonsense. I want to drive. So right now I'm driving from my city. I'm on one of the turnpikes right now. I got one more to go, got a few tunnels and mountains. I'll try to vlog a little bit of that. But right now it's really dark outside. So I'm probably gonna randomly like jump on here, but once the sun comes up, I'll catch that on camera for you guys. And right now it's currently 1.05 in the morning. I started this trip at 12 o'clock, I think. I stopped because I'm chapstick, but that's besides the point. But uh, yeah, so once the sun start coming up, I'll vlog more so that you guys can see me better. You can see the beautiful roads and whatnot. Cause driving from where I live out to Indiana, the views are so beautiful. Like I literally go to like three or four mountains. Oh, my ears fell off. I go, I go through like three or four different mountains. Um, there's a lot of trees and like flowers and like it's winter so like a lot of leaves start to fall. So it's just nice being able to see like more cause like when the trees are fully in season, it's just like, you can't see that far out. But like, y'all see, look, y'all will see, I promise. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'll see you guys in a little bit and I'm about to enjoy this ride. Oh, quick, quick, quick. I really started this vlog because I felt unsafe. So, but it's like, nah, it's like, nah, but, um, driving at night, it's cool, but beware of drivers, like them truckers, because literally I said a flash went off the road, literally, because he was swerving doing 70. I couldn't go around because he was swerving, I was scared. So I stayed behind him, ended up doing 50 and a 70, and he realized he was falling asleep and pulled over. But I'll be back. If anything crazy, if anything else crazy happened, I would definitely give you guys a call. Well, no, I would definitely tune back in. Yeah, I'll be back. It is currently 2.18 and we're going through our third mountain. Um, this one don't have a name on it. So, I guess they're like redoing the signs for this one. to go to the next gas station and has no gas, you're screwed. Cause like these rest stops on the turnpike sometimes are about two hours apart. So just drive smart. Rather to have more than enough gas than no gas at all. Cause I don't know about y'all, but I ain't pushing nothing. I'm gonna sit there and wait for somebody to come help me. But roadside assistance, please help. Like for real. But so I'm out the little mountain. That's why it's so dark. Um, I'll tune back in probably at my rest stop and thanks for tuning in. As you guys can see, it's finally daylight. So I'm like almost about halfway now. I ended up stopping twice because like, I looked at the time. I didn't want to get to my destination too early. You feel me? Like surprise but I don't need to be too much of a surprise like I didn't make sure the person I'm driving out there to see is home so right now it says I should be arriving around 1 o'clock you know 
maybe a little bit earlier, a little bit later, depending on if I stop again. But I probably won't stop again unless I gotta get gas. But I am up now because like I'm a day driver. I hate driving at night because drivers, like the truck people, be tired and like they be swerving. And like another car, another truck was swerving like before I got back on this camera with you guys. Um, yeah, I went through another mountain. It's been cool, like cool so the views are so pretty like when the sun was coming up it was just like rising behind me i was like so i can't wait for the sun to like get in front of me hopefully that happens today while i'm driving but i don't know because it might not be getting ready to like set can get rise in the east to go down the west y'all know what the saying is but Right now it is 8.23 in the morning. Easter's, Easterns, there we go. It's seven, oh, no, I lied again. It is 8.23 Eastern Standard Time. I think I said that right. East Coast, East Coast time, look. <laughs> um, I already did my stops and everything like that. Just driving now, for real, for real. Um, I'm about five hours out. I am officially in Ohio, guys. Um, I've lost track of how far I am, but I am officially on the Ohio Turnpike. Um, this is the last turnpike I need to get on, hopefully. And I'll be at my destination. But look at all this freaking road construction. Like, this is what slows your drive, like your drive down for real. It's right here. This is what slows you down. I was rolling. I was doing a good old 75. Look, never mind. I was doing 70. I was doing speed limit. We don't speed over here. But, um, yeah, so I'll be back when I get a little closer. Bro, can she, like, not know to grab a ticket? Hey, what's going on? So, I was rolling, and then I still got my ticket for the, um, what is this thing called? Some of the tolls is easy pass only because of COVID, but there's one I'm trying to grab this ticket for, and I happen to stop behind some nuns. But, um, yeah, so you made me stop because their easy pass wasn't working. Uh, you should pray, nuns. Should stop, stop, stop. Oh. So I just went to the last rest stop before the rest of my trip. I got me some goodies <laughs> and yes, I'm in a onesie because you gotta ride comfortably. I'm not wearing nothing cute. I'm comfortable, but I'm about to fill up and then I am gonna be at my destination in like less than four hours. I'm super duper excited and nervous at the same time. So we shall see what happens. And I think I am in Ohio right now. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> so currently I am about three hours out. The sky is just so beautiful, you guys. I look at the views. Like, this is why I like driving through the day. Like, I love seeing all this. Like, I love rural areas. Like, they're just so freaking beautiful. But yeah, I got about three more hours. Okay, so I thought the last stop was the last stop. Oh, the handicap button don't even work. Thank you. But yeah. Um, I thought the last stop was going to be the last stop, but it wasn't because I drank too much liquids and now I need to use the restroom. So I'm going to go just grab some snacks again and get some more gas. So, last stretch. I'm for the time. Like, I think I'm less than two hours away. Um, still my PJs. You know your girl fly. Right now it is 12.51. I think it's still Eastern time. I didn't check to see if the time zone switched yet. Um, I don't think it did, but yeah. So, be there soon. Hey you all, so um, now I'm about 30 minutes out, y'all. I'm. It's actually 12.57 now and the time has officially changed. Um, so I'm no longer on the East Coast time, I'm in Midwest time. Um, we finna go to Walmart because your girl hungry again. So, 
Yeah, when I get to Walmart, y'all see my face again. It's just easier to drive and not get distracted if I'm not looking at myself in the camera. That's all. Look at the views. Like, the sky's so cute. Like, vibes. You feel me? Time now is 4.28 Eastern time, East Coast time. Uh, I'm on my way back to Delaware, aka my city. Um, had a nice little weekend getaway, drive, you know. Looks pretty outside right now. So driving safe i ain't see no nothing crazy really since i've been driving the road since i got on a road around lunchtime uh midwest time but back to the normal time zone now so yeah so i'm back on my way to the east coast um i've been driving for almost five hours so i'm like halfway there i think maybe we, we shall see um gonna make my first stop shortly I want Popeyes, and the first one I passed, the rest stop had Popeyes. So now I want Popeyes, but I wasn't ready for gas or stopping yet, cause only like an hour in. I'm like, I just ate like an hour before that, so I'm awake. And the second one I passed only had Burger King. Like, who want Burger King? I want Popeyes. I want chicken. I need a full meal. Like, I probably won't get home till midnight or later, so I'm not gonna eat when I get home. So I need to eat on the road. Oh, this truck trying to hit me! Oh my god! Oh my god! This truck trying to hit me! Okay, back to normal. But, um, yeah, so I'm hopefully gonna stop at the next express stop. I'm like half tank right now. And I really want some chicken or full meal. Like, I don't care, whatever comes first. So, I think I see one of them little blue signs for when like the plaza's coming up. Let me see what it says. Oh, that says lodging. Okay, well, when I stop, I'll try to remember to get back on here and let you guys get up here. Okay, so I'm coming up on like the next service plaza, but they only got Hardee's. Anybody got time for Hardee's right now? No offense to Hardee's, but I need something hefty. And it's saying the next service station is less than 25 miles away. So I'm just going to push it till I get there because there ain't no other food option there. And I still got a lot of gas left. I usually go at half tank, but I want some more food. And I ain't going to keep stopping. So I'm not going to go here and see it 25 miles later. And I'm going to just win. So. Next to Plaza, it is. <laughs> yeah. So it is currently 8.19 East Coast time. Um, I already stopped at two rest stops. One to get some cake and some gas. The other one to get some Popeyes because the first one, nothing really was open. So I'm getting ready to stop again. This will be my last stop before I get home. Um, about like four and a half hours out. This drive going cool. Ain't nobody crazy to really happening besides that one incident when I truck was trying to ride my bumper. But it's cool. Like, I missed the sunset because it was, like, at an angle. I couldn't get it on video for y'all without not paying attention to the road. But, yeah, so, almost home. I am currently, like, three and a half hours away from home. Um... It's really pretty out here, so I'm going to flip the camera and let you guys enjoy the view.